Hey, what's going on there, YouTube? This is uh, JVS back here again for another reaction trailer. This time, it's not actually of anything specific because it encompasses the CW Fall lineup 2015. I think they did this before, so I'm kind of surprised that they're doing it again. But it's about just one minute, so I'm curious to see what new scenes maybe come up for Arrow or Flash. If it's not anything big, I might not even post this video up. Uh, but and for the sake of it, you know what? I'm going to do that. Then after that, I'm going to actually do a review reaction to... Uh, believe it or not, once upon a time, I actually used one of my favorite shows. Um, I stopped around the second season because uh, so many other shows that came up. But I've been looking at the re revelations that's been going on with a different character, and I want to actually go and uh, go back and look at all of those and start doing the reviews for the season five when it comes up. But anyway, without further ado, this is the CW Fall 2015 promo video. Ah, uh, that's from Man from Uncle. You seen that in IMAX tomorrow? Ah, zombie, we are defiant. Ha! <laughs> Fast, fearless, arrow, immortal, Damon and Stephen, pregnant, <laughs> defy the world. Forgot the name of that, Jane. Ah, uh, dare to be thrilled. I can't remember what that one was. The originals. Oh snap! They got the whole cast back. Premiering this October. Flash Eye Zombie. Tuesday, October the 6th. Arrow is going to be with. Wait, Supernatural still going on? Wednesday, October the 7th. Mm, mm, mm. Vampire Diaries and the Originals coming on the same night on Thursday. That's awesome. Rain is on Friday by itself. Jane the Virgin is crazy. Ex girlfriend is going to be on Mondays. I'm down for that. Thank you. Thank you, CW. You finally freaking listen to me. Taking the originals and putting them with the same night as Vampire Diaries is genius because now that uh, Nina DeBrieve is no longer with the cast, like they're gonna need really all the hype they can get, and, you know. And I, I for one, have preferred it to be on Thursdays because Mondays it was competing against Gotham, it was competing against um, what was the other show? Oh my gosh, Blacklist and um, Scorpions as well. And uh, now, like, Supergirl is about to come out, and it's competing with freaking um, Gotham. The same exact night, the same exact time. And I think the executive producer, he was like, well, this is a totally different drama for different people, and it's going to reach a dem different demographic. And that's true. But you got two of the same properties, and you're going to have them go up against each other? That doesn't make any rational sense. If you want to outsource, like, Put it for a different time. All you have to do is put it for 8 o'clock and let it go up against Scorpion. If it can hold its own, then, then move it up to that point. I mean, that doesn't make sense to me. And, I mean, CBS, to me, I think that they're going to probably try to keep there being crossovers for Arrow and Legends of Tomorrow. Matter of fact, Legends of, Legends of Tomorrow didn't even get featured in this promo. It was weird. But anyway, um, I mean, the fact is, it led to tomorrow. You got the Flash, you got Arrow, even a zombie, like all part of DC Universe. They're not competing against each other. For them to even say, like, okay, you got Gotham, and like that's you know that's Fox, but still, like it's still the same like DC property. Like, why would you go and compete with that? That doesn't make sense to me. Uh, I think that somebody had tried to compare um, the Agents of Shield and what was the other show that was going on at the same exact time. There was another show that was going on at the same exact time, but it was a totally different corporation. It wasn't, it wasn't uh, Marvel versus Marvel. It was a whole different one. And yeah, that, that they did hold each other on its own, but that just didn't seem like a good business move to me. But anyway, I look forward to the fall CW, and I'm going to go ahead and do this uh, reaction video to uh, Once Upon a Time real quick. Thanks, everybody, for watching. Please leave a like if you enjoyed this. I apologize. I can't show y'all the actual video. I can't do any edits on my laptop. If y'all don't want me to do any videos at all, just let me know in the comment section below if y'all would prefer to be able to actually be able to visually watch what you're doing. So I apologize. Hopefully, y'all enjoyed this. Later, everybody. JVS, we out.